Tomorrow's World, ready to be explored at the International Motor Show in Frankfurt. Cars that can see and hear, fitted with sensors, radars and cameras. Intelligent vehicles, thanks to digital technology. Advanced Driver Assistance Systems, or ADAS, help drivers navigate through traffic. No more accidents because of blind spots. If a car veers off course, the wheel vibrates and responds. Intelligent vehicle technology is already a reality, but researchers are fine-tuning it all the time. Fatigue detection, for example, the main sensor for fatigue detection is the steering angle sensor. The driver is characterized on the basis of his or her steering characteristics, the way they steer, in other words. There are various ways that people drive. So if you're on the highway, the system can detect when you start to get tired. The system is linked to the navigation and knows that a service station is coming up ahead and can alert the driver. Marco Schneider from Continental, a major automotive supplier, researches emergency brake assistance. At the International Motor Show, visitors can see what happens when a car traveling at 50 kilometers per hour has to make an emergency stop. Lasers and cameras allow for early detection of danger. Imagine if the system could work at such an early stage that the driver would say, well, I don't need the system because there would have been a chance to steer clear of the obstacle or brake. You need to decide exactly how to calibrate a system so that it only breaks when the driver has no chance of avoiding an accident. Technological advances reserved for higher-end vehicles will eventually trickle down to the affordable brands. Experts say that the advanced driver assistance systems help reduce the number of accidents. But they also warn against overwhelming drivers with new technologies. Driver assistance systems are intended to help drivers, particularly in critical situations. It's very important that they don't distract them. For example, if the light is too bright or blinks in a hectic manner, Drivers should not be reacting to the system, but instead controlling their vehicles. Smartphones can be a dangerous distraction. To avoid that, cars of the future will be directly plugged into the Internet, and drivers will be able to choose from a wide range of apps, including anything from entertainment to safety information. British upmarket car manufacturers Bentley offer their exclusive customers a car that acts as a mobile office, complete with internet connection and a device that allows you, for example, to operate the radio from the back seat. In this luxury segment of the market, autonomous motoring usually means that a chauffeur is behind the wheel. In the meantime, most car manufacturers are working on the idea of a car that can drive itself. This involves a vehicle that is networked with its surroundings via sensors and radars and can accurately assess an immense amount of data. At the moment, this is still the job of human beings. People are definitely able to master complex situations that they encounter for the first time. An intelligent machine is still unable to do that at the moment. Smart cars and technology may be helpful in the future, but they can't replace the pure joy of driving. <laughs>